So apparently, and excuse the pronunciation, there's a German word called schlingel, and it basically means rascal. Mm. Now, I think the behavior of Uli Hoeneß, the what, Bayern president what is it again? here... What, what is it again? I think it's schlingel. Okay. Right? All right. The behavior of Uli Hoeneß, the Bayern president, by saying, well, if Ter Stegen takes over the national team starting goalkeeper from Manuel Neuer, we're not going to release any Bayern players. Come on. That's a nonsense, isn't it? Of course it's a nonsense, because... In him coming out and saying this, now you have established evidence in which then the national team could say to FIFA, hey, th this club is not releasing their players. They've established what the reason is. And so, therefore, you could actually make a case against Bayern Munich and against Uli Hoeneß to the point to where FIFA can then say, well, these guys can't play in the league game either. If they can't play with the national team, there is an avenue that you can pursue, if you so desire, in which the players can now be told you cannot play with your uh, club team either. And so, is, that, is this where we are with the national team and Germany? For so many years, they have been the picture of stability, of structure, of organization, of discipline, on the field, off the field, what everybody wants to be. And now, over the last, i say, year and a half or so, it's been a caricature of what we have expected from the Germans in years past. Some of, the, some of it has to do with the national team, and some of it has to do with the presence in, in, in the world of football of a guy like Uli Hoeneß, who mm -hmm. continues to make these outlandish statements, and, and little does he know, or ignorant to the fact that he is actually now clear a path by which the national team and FIFA can say, this is all the evidence we need. We can clearly make a case against you and against Bayern Munich. Let's cut to the chase. You and I have done many games together. We've seen Manuel Neuer, and Manuel Neuer has been magnificent. Mm. But I'm not sure he is what he was. Mm -hmm. And you watch Barca every weekend, and Ter Stegen is a lot of the time flawless. I, I understand why they would be thinking, well, there's going to come a time soon where there'll be a changing of the guard. Who would you have as your number one right now? Well, Ter Stegen is the number one, yeah. or should be, in, in terms of where they are in their careers, it should be Ter Stegen. However, I can understand why Yogi Lowe says, you know what, maybe I pick Manuel Neuer simply because of the leadership, the presence, captain of the team. Those things have value as well. But if it is just about playing and playing levels, there is no doubt, there is no question that Ter Stegen has been far more consistent than Manuel Neuer has been over the last 18 months or so. The only, the only case that you have to make is Ter Stegen has been available. Minor lawyer has been injured a lot of, in, a lot of the time. Yep. And, 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 and at some point, you have to say, okay, well, it is time to transition on to the next phase, on to the next guy. Who's going to be the next guy? Transitions are never easy. Breakups are never easy. Telling somebody that you know you're not good enough right now, that's never easy. But that is the job of a guy like Yogi Lowe, who is trying as best as he can to create a new identity for this German national team. And the longer guys like Manuel Neuer hang on, the more difficult it becomes. Just ask Iker Casillas in Spain and, and, and learn from that episode and learn from the fact that if you have a guy that is hanging on, hanging on, hanging on, and you have somebody else coming that is at this point better, Yogi Lowe has to make that decision. And the clubs, the clubs should not have any power to then step in and say, we're not going give to give you our players. That is just ridiculous. It's nonsense, and it's to the point to where it becomes embarrassing. The Yugi Love you mentioned, that's the, the German national coach, isn't it? It's not Uli Hoeneß right now. I haven't, I haven't mistaken that. Well, I don't think it is. I think Uli Hoeneß is at Bayern right now. He's not involved with the German national team anymore, so maybe it's best if he just stays out of their business. Rascal. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.